Connecting Arizona. 12 News Today starts now. Well, you know what eating right means? Eating fat. That's right, you heard me right. You can eat fat and lose weight. To help us out is Dr. Eric Wood. Doctor, is this true or is this a misnomer? Well, Gwyneth Paltrow, yes. Kobe Bryant, and Matthew McConaughey all look great and have great figures, as we know. Yes. But one of their tips to staying looking so great is they eat a lot of good fat okay. and so avoid wait a sugar. So we're not talking about like mauling a pie or a bag of chips or something like that. That's not the kind of fat you're talking not about. Not the kind of fat. We're going to qualify that today. Okay. Talk to what we've got right here. You said that the average person will have this much sugar. Oh, you're spilling. I know. Well, <laughs> uh, oh, no, in a week. That is the average two pounds in a week that Americans are eating, 22 teaspoons a day. Oh my gosh, what are we eating? I mean, my, that seems like outrageous. So work your way down the line and tell us what's good for us. Yeah, so these are some good fats we brought here today. This is some grass-fed beef jerky. Great, tasty, summertime's coming up, barbecues, yeah. steaks are great too, grass-fed we wanna go. Um, olive oil and olives, great as salad, garnishes, dressings, etc. Um, organic avocados, we've got a California variety, any variety is great, and nuts besides peanuts are okay. fantastic. So no Let's peanuts, no peanuts, right? Who eats like two or three of those? I mean, if you open this bag, odds are so the you, bag is going to be gone. You don't have to eat two or three. You can have yes. 24 is a serving size of almonds. That's like a handful though, right? It's a quarter cup. Yeah. About. So <laughs> it's, but the thing about fat is it gives us messages that we actually are getting full and we don't want to overeat. You don't okay. see people gorging on olive oil. No, 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 no. And then uh, we love the fact that you get some cheese in there too. Raw cheese is fantastic or okay. raw dairy period. It's got something called CLA in it. Okay. It helps us burn fat. Wow. All right, now what are these other items you brought here? So how are we gonna get the sugar out? Well, I brought some sugar substitutes. So ah, smart. organic stevia, only need an eighth the amount you mm. need to get the same sweet as sugar. Mm -hmm. Zero calories, zero glycemic index, which means zero fat. Gain. Why do you keep pointing at me when you say that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, molasses and palm sugar are great for bakers. Uh, so yeah. instead of using the, the brown sugar, this is much more nutritive and lower glycemic index. Mm -hmm. And finally, our last two items over here. Our last two, monk fruit and erythritol. So monk fruit comes from Asia, not monks. Okay. okay. And, <laughs> right. uh, very little calories, but a great natural taste. So people, it comes in little packets that are really easy to use. And then for the artificial sweetener people, we know who you are. <laughs> you think you're doing yourself a favor, but say no to the chemicals. We really no want something chemicals. naturally derived like erythritol, which comes from vegetables and fruits. Doc, great job. Look at people out there are gonna be having fat and we're gonna have skinny viewers out there this morning. Thank you very much for coming mm. in. My pleasure.